All right, back in the garage, got a whole situation happening here. Uh, don't worry about that mess, but all you need to know is that we've got an RX-8 E-Pass rack. It's got its torque sensor and its motor hooked up to the filter, a stock controller, um, ignition power going to this battery, and then we've got the, uh, the GROM E-Pass uh, enable uh, doohickey majigger here. So basically what's gonna happen is I'm gonna connect up power to the battery, and we're gonna hear some relays click, and we'll have power steering from the unit. And we'll watch our, uh, our two LEDs here as I do that. So here we go. So there's the power LED, and once the E-Pass is enabled, there we go, it's illuminated. So uh, once that LED is illuminated, we know that the E-Pass is enabled. So if we pull power, we'll hear the relays click back off. There we go, and E-Pass is disabled, obviously. One fun feature of this E-Pass enable is that it will always tell you what the status of the E-Pass is. So let's say you decide to swap a LS1 into your RX-8 and you detonate out a piston and the piston hits the torque, uh, the torque sensor and disconnects it. Well, we just got the torque sensor and what do you know, the E-Pass is disabled. So it'll tell you exactly what's going on, sort of.